got ourselves a new three inch flex bike. Yes, three inch. Three inch tubing. A full custom three inch turbo back exhaust. Pie cuts and all the works. Novice welder. I made it work. And we got a little three inch pipe sticking out of the back. I just had to cut the bumper a little bit to kind of get it out from behind the bumper. It was uh, actually pretty, pretty bad in the car. The way that it smelled at idle and at stop signs and stop lights and stuff was pretty bad uh, without having it sticking out past the bumper. So I definitely needed to do that. All right, so we're gonna throw a little clip in here with the GTI and uh, just some of the little sound clips that we got about uh, doing some flybys on it now. In editing, it didn't sound that great on phones and tablets. So if you have headphones, you might want to plug those in. Or if you have like computer speakers or something, tablets and phones don't really do it justice. Fun? Oh, this thing is awesome. Previous to the muffler, it was just too loud to drive. Couldn't really start it in our neighborhood after it got dark out and stuff, so uh, definitely a needed improvement. Now that we have it on there, can drive it no problem, day or night. It seems just fine. And I did just get back from Indiana, which is about a 700 mile trip one way and then 700 miles back. Uh, the car is still doing quite well. Uh, the exhaust still hasn't burned the car down, so. That's a plus. The uh, exhaust is not too loud. I was afraid that the exhaust would still be kind of loud with a straight pipe and a straight through muffler. So um, I'm pretty glad that it's at the level that it's at right now, so. And she did great. There was no problems with the exhaust whatsoever. Nobody pulled me over for the exhaust. I did get pulled over for a tail light out at one point, uh, about 10 minutes from my house, which is kind of surprising. The officer didn't say anything about my exhaust being too loud, so. I'm pretty sure that this exhaust is going to be fine and I shouldn't have to worry about it. It is a Flowmaster FX muffler that I put on there. I saw some videos online and they didn't really have any good sound uh, for a four cylinder. They were all on V8s, which are pretty good, but this will give you an idea what it sounds like on a four cylinder. And it worked really well. I like the way it sounds. And I did get it from Summit Racing. I think it was about 40 or $50. It wasn't very expensive at all. And the peace of mind and the, the droniness that's gone now from that car is just uh, it's an unbelievable change and it's a straight through muffler so it doesn't really rob any performance which is, which is really nice hopefully you guys uh like this video and enjoyed hearing what the custom exhaust sounds like if you guys are interested in, in trying to do one of those it's very rewarding to have it sound nice when you're done even if you're just trying it for the first time i highly recommend giving it a shot anyway hope you enjoyed this video please like comment subscribe and we'll see you next time